Hey guys, welcome back. In today's video, we're going to be talking about this National League matchup here between the San Francisco Giants and the Miami Marlins. We give our lean on where we see the better value standing on the money line. The road team, the Giants, coming in as slight favorites at about minus 115 on the year right now. The Giants at a 500 record, 33 and 33 overall in comparison over to the Marlins, who have been one of the weaker teams in the NL with just a mark of 24 and 42 overall. And talking about the road team here, the Giants in game one of this series, coming up short, losing in Miami by a final of five to seven. So they're going to look to try to bounce back, get things back on track here today in game two. And this is coming off of a pretty successful series prior on the road against the Washington Nationals, where the Giants were able to grab two wins in that three game series. And also this has been a trend that we've been seeing from the Giants over the past couple weeks of action. They went on during this stretch to sweep the Phillies three games to zero at home and then also following that with a two games to one win at home over the Diamondbacks and then that led into that Washington National Series where the Giants had some success and now they're trying to continue to carry that into what should be a more manageable opponent here for San Francisco on the year right now the Giants in terms of their pitching 22nd in the majors in earned run average and then their batting numbers 16th in runs scored today Giants going to be setting out 27 year old Chris Stratton who's made 13 starts this year sitting on a 4.63 ERA 7-3 and three overall record his last outing. He came out a little early, went four innings against the Arizona Diamondbacks, giving up seven hits, three earned runs, two walks to three strikeouts. But today, taking on the Marlins, who are certainly one of the weaker teams. We look at their numbers, the Miami Marlins at 27th in the majors in total team earned run average, and they're just 29th in run scored. Putting consistent runs on the board has been a major issue for the Marlins this year. Today, Miami sending out 25-year-old righty Trevor Richards, who's made six starts this year, sitting on a 5.02 ERA in his last outing. Richards, kind of similar numbers actually to what we saw from the Giants starter in his last outing as Richards went five innings on the road against the Cardinals, giving up seven hits, three earned runs, uh, zero walks to four strikeouts. So in terms of this pitching matchup, somewhat even and then definitely you give the offensive edge over to the Giants and with San Francisco coming into this one today looking to get a bounce back victory against what has been one of the weaker teams in the National League sitting on the money line at just minus 115 we feel like San Francisco is going to be the better value play so we're siding with the road team taking the Giants on the money line if you agree give the video a thumbs up disagree give it a thumbs down check out all of our picks over at stumpthespread.com linked down in the video description. Subscribe for more, and we hope to see you guys back here for tomorrow's video. Bye.